covering that in the intersection points of two thirds. So now we are entering the fourth wall. You have these uh, shadows, nice shadows of this grill. So we'll take that. It's moving. So we, I need to be very quick in taking this shot. It's going to be a portrait, a portrait orientation shot. Let's do that. Yeah, it was moving a little bit, but I did get the shot. Let me take some landscape orientation shot. So we'll take some favorite shot of mine before the shadow goes off to, uh, by the noon. Hope that is in focus. It's kind of made, had made my thing, you know, like as a signature shot. Uh, now the security camera is not interesting unless and until you have some curve and lines into it. Yeah, unless you bring some curves and lines into it. By the way, I'm at uh, F16 and uh, shutter speed 250. Yeah, I kind of like this. That was good. That kind of interests me in a Dutch angle. funny shot I've removed my sunglasses because like kind of makes my shot look much darker So 
so we covered the roof of that uh, beach house through this entrance and it was a portrait shot we have some interesting light here but i would like some subject to be standing Yeah, that was a good shot. Oh no, everyone has come out. Probably it's good high time for me to get inside, but I will do that later because uh, it might get even hotter if I'm going to come out here. I like this shadow. shoot this I'll try not to be in the frame This is a decent shot. We have some one more interesting frame. This line, this line, and this line. So we'll try to put that properly. So it was a good shot. Students getting a bashing from the teacher for roaming alone. You always do that. That's the fun and it's a good memory. Just looking if I could include those trees part of this yeah, fort wall. I don't know. I don't know if it will work. That was good.
स्वेट इज गेटिंग इन टू माई आईज आज वन कंटिन्यूज रिकॉर्डिंग फॉर फोर्टी टू मिनट एज ऑफ नाउ सो आई फाउंड फ्यू शॉर्ट फ्रॉम दिस प्लेस वी आर गेटिंग देयर नाउ सो stand from that spot and take that store rooms how to put I think it will be it will make a good frame if those two couples you know will walk in front of the front a little front in the path yeah It was nice. I was able to take the shot. It's wide view and have two subjects here, and few of them walking on wall. I would have still preferred, you know, like an empty frame, but it's a bad choice to come over here at this point of time. Probably I should have gotten inside the museum. I'm like, I'm worrying because, like. As you watch the video, you might feel bad. I don't feel bad at all. But so I was trying to place the fort in the bottom part of the frame and have uh, as much sky as possible. So. I don't mind this because like it's my life so I'm bringing you guys into my life so hope you don't hope you guys also don't mind about this आमा पर्सनल Please please So I had few of them walk by That was some interesting film and no if they want to start on this Hope you guys understand what I was doing. You know, I have a single subject.
and very unfortunate at a very short distance here we have two leading lines to that uh, triangle but uh, but i couldn't place a proper subject in the center though i place it uh, you know have them in the center i may not be able to show you the leading lines so kind of in an awkward situation but it was a good shot though yeah those photographs came out good you have some fort wall gaps for keeping the cannons here probably that opening is for the soldiers to stand so we are walking in the anti clockwise direction and uh, by walking this way we will get to the entrance of that museum same stuff but i don't find any interesting frame as of now water tank probably <laughs> how many times i would take a water tank photograph no i don't find the church to be interesting probably i can put that in a portrait orientation and have take it I placed the church in the bottom part of the frame. Good that this is an extra sensor, not a monochrome sensor, so that I can recover the highlights as much as possible. Though my exposure value is at minus three, you know, I still find some uh, uh, highlights brightened up way too much than it is because I can't lower my shutter speed even more because I'm worried about. recovering other shadows and stuff but with all this color filter are you know i can recover the highlights with no worries so in the fpv first person view we are going to cross this danish church's fort wall you have some demolished houses here this is uh, mostly the fishing village You know, four kilometers was about uh, for the da Dutch colony to establish. And rest of the place was fishing village where uh, Dutch colony people are allowed to collect taxes for themselves. Probably I'll have much of the talking to do inside the museum. I absolutely have no idea what is uh, what in the museum. Not like the exact stuff that is there. I have a overall idea which I shared with you earlier. But uh, as of now, this is what I got to say about uh, this fort wall. You know, I actually imagined about uh, taking a shot with this fence. uh now that i have here i'm here i don't find a proper composition where i could place this fence in a you know bouquet manner or a blood stuff and have the subject from the rear to be in focus so damn it's going to be some one long video that much i can say So I'll give a break as we are about to enter into the museum, and this is what is the outside wall of the fort. Looks like mostly for these places to have access to fire with their arms, you know, from this place, you know, for the people who have come to attack the people who have come to. 
occupy this fort it's the duchess who had this place for a long time this is a nice scenic view i'm at f16 infinity We have few people walking there, and and a catamaran, and a couple of people sitting in the catamaran. And beach. <clears throat> Last time when we visited Kadalur, that booth bungla, booth in the sense like ghost bungalow. <laughs> I mean like the abandoned fort which we found over there. I do not know if I would find a proper fine art frame with this. Oops, I accidentally pressed the 4K recording again. I might have to delete that. Yeah, we are good to go. By the way, this is the very first time this is happening, right? You guys know it, you guys are traveling with me for every photo walk. So this is the very first time I've been hitting the function button quite often. And I'm hitting the function button because like I'm not holding the lens like this to vlog. Rather I was holding it on my exposure button and my thumb accidentally hits the function button for movie recording. I think even now it is recording a movie. Yep, it is. I'm going to have to delete it again. Mm-hmm. Nope. Why am I coming here? Because like I found a well or kind of a Yeah, it's a well filled with a lot of plastics. These are really hard to maintain, you know. A punch I can tell because uh, from the fee that we gave, I was I'm the only person here shooting video and stills as of today. And uh, you have visitors but the entry ticket is like very cheap so government have to generate revenue to maintain all these things and they can't shell out their own uh, money from their you know whatever you call the uh, their treasury department you know so it's going to cost them a, a lot of money so it's not nobody to be blamed but It would be nice if, uh, even after the independence, if uh, the people who build this, the country could take care of their own stuff in the other countries, you know, it will be well maintained. So that's the fort wall around, you know, so we are going to walk out in a minute, we are walking out here. <laughs> 